Why, hello there. Hello, Maris. This is Gamer Quest. Welcome. Oh my god, it's Wednesday, and here I am. Um, trying to record stuff for YouTube, in a sense, kind of, sort of, so, you know, YouTube gets an update every day, plus... There's a good chance my schedule is going to be changing, depending on what happens with my new job. Like I said last night, I officially got it. Um, I'm waiting for them to contact me back on when the start date's going to be, so for a little while there, I'm going to be working like six, seven days a week until we figure everything out. So, we're going to do some more first looks. Uh, this is a DLC that we're going to be taking a look at. Um, this is for the game Northgard. I am a big fan of this game. Um, so I'm going in already liking this game. If you want to see what it's about, I do have a, uh, recording previously down over on YouTube, which is just the standard, um, I guess board you can say that we're going to do now. They have officially released. They're not in early access anymore. They added a campaign mode, which is actually pretty freaking cool. I haven't finished playing through that because I just like, like, the core strategy game, I guess, of it enough that I've only, I think, gone to the third board or fifth board of the campaign. Like, really, you know, I've spent 55 hours playing this game, so I'd say I've invested a little bit of time in this. But we're going to be taking a look at a new clan called the Clan of the Snake, the Svathner. I believe is how it's pronounced. Uh, these guys are a little different as far as how you win. Um, with the game, I'll get into that. Let me get into the game and I'll I'll show you what I'm talking about. Because, um, just for simplicity purposes, we're gonna, um, do a single player game with this, uh, clan. I'm not going to try and see if they're in the campaign. I don't know if they're in the campaign. So, we're gonna play a single-player game. I'm Maris, of course. We're gonna be black. Um, we're gonna do a small map size. We'll go against one person. Um, now, here's the thing. Do you see these victory conditions? Depending on what's going on, there are different ways to win. From what I understand, the, the Snake Clan is not eligible for fame victories. So, this is, um, not, here we go, Clan of the Snake. Ooh, the Clan of the Snake, cunning and deceitful. The Snake has little regard for fame or honor. Okay. Members of the clan prefer working in the shadows and using guerrilla tactics rather than open warfare. Starting bonuses. Oh, I think... If I read the update correctly and the premise behind these, these guys get better the longer the game goes and the more aged your clan gets. So, age 15, the cunning, and this is a based on a hero style. So, we're going to be playing Signe. At least, I, from what I read, going to be kind of lurking. Oh, I feel better, Monica. And what's up, I be lurking? So, we got age 15, the cunning. You start with your war chief, the young Signe. Iron is not needed to summon Signy. That's a good thing. The clan doesn't have access to fame. Signy grows up, getting stronger and unlocking new abilities instead. That explains the fame thing. So bonuses. Age 16, pride with the clan. Signy gains 20% more move speed and can now attack at range. Age 18, tears of the earth. Signy can use scorched earth to burn any zone during three months. It has a three-month cooldown. Cool burn zone, negative 50% production. Ouch. Snakes, units, and buildings, plus 50% attack. Signy can go through tiles with foes without engaging combat. Wow. Really? Really? That's interesting. So, this is, this is a strike. I'm, I'm imagining this is going to start out the base the same way. So, I'm fairly certain I should be able to do a small, um, you know, a small campaign or a small map. So what I'm doing right now is I'm building a scout, another village hut, and, um, a woodcutter. The, uh, village hut is gonna make people happy, and so... You'd select person, you right-click, they turn into a scout. Scouts, you need to be able to scout zones to open up so you can purchase them. So we've got a house. So that provides shelter up your, up your amount. Woodcutter, we're going to right-click her in. 
What's up, Thriller? What's up, Doctor? So now we have a woodcutter. See, that's how you assign them. Um, unless you upgrade, they're usually two per hut. This is Signe. She can't do anything right now. She looks like a badass, though. All right, what do we got? We have wolves here. Siggy should be, is a warrior class, I'm guessing. So this will be good. Um, which we'll call it. Clan of the Ram or Clan of the Sheep can actually build, colonize, can actually build sheep folds and get food and put sheep in them. I don't think they can do this skirmisher camp oh new military unit oh yes woodcutters lodge healers hut we like healer huts i need you to build this uh good we can do hunters here let's get siggy over here A lot of this has to do with really fine-tuning. Like like I said, I'm fairly certain I should be able to get through a small map. Going by what I know from the other clans. Now, this is a completely different thing. Uh, not, I shouldn't say different thing. New clan. You're gonna heal, mister. And you're gonna heal Siggy. Or Signy, or whatever her name is. All right, we're going to colonize. What time is it? May? That over there next to me, that little map helps you figure out. It'll also show you, like, events that are coming up. If, um... Let's get another woodcutter over here. I need them to work. I need a hunter's lodge. As a joke, from what I understand, this is also called the Viking Starvation RTS. I personally have yet to have a problem with my food supply, but that is all a matter of making sure you get the right stuff up and going early on in the building process. They did a really great job with this. Oh, the farm, nice. This is going to give us food too. Um, Hunter's Lodge. Come on, come on, come on. I need more food. You'll eventually come to a point where you're not going to want to um, build or spend food. I'm a good strategist. It took me a bit to learn to actually get the trick to this game. Because all these different, like for instance, let's click this. This is a forest tile. If you notice next to me, it explains it. You need to pay attention to those things. That makes a big difference. Those little bonuses, it's like so 10% extra wood you know you're sticking a woodcutter's lodge there and upgrading them like there's certain little things that you pick up that if you don't realize what's going on it's like you know i want this farm area How many villagers do I have? Three. All right, we're going to take him from gathering food, and we're going to make him gather more food. Oh, Blue Dragon! What's up? We are conquering everyone. I actually usually go for domination um, victories. I've done fame victories. Like, I've, I'm trying, because I'm a loser like that, I'm trying to get all the achievements. Because... I'm a gatherer of achievements, so... So, so far, the basic here, obviously. It's August. I'm gonna buy this farm and then that's it for the winter to come because I'm probably not gonna make... Well, I... Mm. We'll see. We shall see. Come on! Achievement Junkie. Go, go, go! 80! Oh yeah, yeah. Come on! I need to hit it before September. That'll just barely give me enough time. Bam! I'm gonna need a 
farm. Can I build fields? 80. Yes, I can. And then that's all the wood I can use. Alright. You head over there. And I need to build a, build a village. At least we get lore. So this, you're... Oh, hey, hold on a minute. Oh, look at this. We're about to, we're almost ready to unlock this. You get a tree for each one of these. Um, they're each clan specific. So, like I said, like this right here, how it has the snake emblem, that is only for the snake clan. So all of these actually have different things worked into them, depending on who you play. I found the clan of Fenrir, which is the wolf, was the easiest to start out with because they get certain bonuses and things like that. Um, Alright, we're gonna do it. I'm doing it. I'm being a freaking rebel. I shouldn't, but I am. I need to raise my people anyway. Alright, you, start farming. Artwork in this is good if you get up on these people. It's very cute. All right, so this right here is hidden treasures. This is an iron mine, too. Um, I want this forest. I, um... I need to get... How many civilians? Four civilians. Hmm? Oh, a cheer! Thank you! Thank you, thank you, thank you! Oh, here we go. All right, so... You accumulate lore on your own. Um, I'll just show you this real quick. Whoops. Let me come down here. This is a rune stone. You can assign someone to it and they'll pray to the gods and you'll get... I want all the things. I do. So, sharp axes, under pressure. Alright, we're going to do sharp axes right now because this is the military. Um, it's pretty much, this is like your... How would you say, like, colonizing and, like, you know, town, medicine, recruitment, things like that. This is your military branch, and this is your trading and money. Ooh, black market. Oh, my God. Nice. Oh, I'm doing that. Exploration bonus of special tiles is doubled. Oh! Stolen lore. Steal lore from other cl Oh my god, these guys are crazy. Permanently increase your military unit to plus 2% per enemy civilian killed. Ooh, these guys are brutal. Oh, now, see how, see how I've got this? Now, if you notice, I have a max of 500. Yeah, I'm already wanting on the black, so I'm gonna spend my money like a psychopath. And here we go, go. we're gonna go right into winter, which is gonna... Bam! Ooh, good. See this? We're still plus six. I'm okay with this. And we're still... We still have plenty of firewood. Okay. So let us... Get this over here. I need you. Let's hope this doesn't kill my plus food. It only took three. Okay. These guys collect food for you. It's really important. It's really important to, like, actually keep a lot of villagers. You'd be surprised. I need to build mines. I've got some mines on each of these. Um, skirmisher camp. We're still plus... Okay. Alright, we're gonna take him and do this. Okay. We're gonna take... Yeah, this shows you your territories. Other other clans' territories, depending on what color they are, will be, like, red or purple or blue. That just shows you. And then the lines in between these gray and white lines are your different tiles. Like, this tile, for instance, is stones, obviously. And it also had farmland. This was forest, but we've also got a lure stone. You know, it gives you, depending on what you click. Um... 
I need you there. We're up to six villagers. That's a good thing. We're getting you to go work, son. Do work, son. We've discovered Yggdrasil. All right, so this is a special tile. I can win by taking this over. However, it is 2,000 um, food to take over. FYI. And our next thing is going to be a silo because I need to have more food because once the summer clicks in, as you see, we're coming up close to the green section. That kind of just shows you your seasons. But um, we're losing money too. I need a trading post. ASAP! Do I have... Uh... We definitely need a trading post. I need money. I can't build military units without money. And I need another village hut. Eesh. Scout was hurt. Come on, come on, come on. We're getting close. Yes, we are. Bam! Nice! That's awesome. That is awesome, awesome. All right. Let's get our trading post. I'm gonna put it here. We need another house. How many's on this? This is two out of four. What is this? Yes, two out of four. We've established Cobalt Contact. You can open trade routes with these guys. Where are they? All right, see this gray? How it fades in? That's their territory. They've got a circle of stones right there. Ooh. No, the trees never actually, quote-unquote, go away. It's like they just keep... They'll, they'll pop back up and respawn. It's like infinite infinite resources, so to speak, but it's like a trickle, trickle effect, you know, you can only, you know, you, it takes so much, oh, here we go, what do we got? We're gonna get a little extra money going with the trading, because I still don't need to worry about military units right now. Um, oh shit, sorry. All right. These guys are tough. Um, we want this. All right. I need a merchant. Let me find someone. Here you go. Go make me money. And you make me money too. Not so good. I have how many guys over here? This is two. Okay. Alright, we need this tile. So I'm going to bring Signe over here and she's going to fight. And we're going to look into building some military units. Training camp. Yeah, let's do it. Right. Everybody's looking happy so far. All right, let's do a feast. Now, feast is a good buff to use. Can you add the live notification to Discord? I will look into that. All right, so she's getting healed. Where's my scout? Oh, let him do this real quick. Ooh, what's in this square? Is it a wolf den? I bet it is. Look at those stats up there. We're doing good. It's a wolf den. Alright. Let's have that explored. Let's get a civilian over here. We're 
gonna stick a mine right here. This is a villager, you can build it. If you build it, they will come. All right, so see how that says we have a blizzard coming up? We're going to build a silo. Villager to do that. Um, that's going to increase the amount we can... Uh... That's fine. That's perfectly A-OK. -okay. I got a lore master. I do... Oh, look, he's named! Oh! Oh, they're all named now! They had a, a little update, too. So, it looks like we've got names now. They were never named before. Olaf! What's up, Olaf? Brynhilda! Oh, that's awesome. Scuff. Work harder, Scuff. Guther! Guthrie. Guther? That's cool. I, that That's a fun little feature. Alright, so we have our mine built. This is iron right here. That exclamation point is uh, the blizzard, which is going to go on for the whole winter. And it's going to screw up your uh, people big time. Alright, people are not happy with me. Let us... What's the issue? I need more territory. That's what I need. All right. Nice. Um. Oh, we're doing black market. No trade routes, just the call balls. And thanks for playing. Can she? Can she just singly take these guys out? Or at least one of them out, because these guys hit like a tank. Oh yeah, she definitely can't do all of them. Alright, hold up, hold up. Let's get my... Skirmishers, skirmishers, okay. Axe thrower, bam. You can come over here. They're surviving, but they could definitely be happier. I want to hear your mouth. Right. Oh, she's ranged now. I forgot about that. She got the ability of her range at uh, 12, 16, I believe. This is the tough thing. Happiness is tough. I can't even organize a feast. Ooh, here comes the snow already. Eek! I need you to go. Ooh, my people are pissed now. Alright. Let's finish killing these people. I need my people to not be mad at me. <laughs> It could be like a western in a sense. Alright, we're upgrading. Hopefully this will... Anything? No? Didn't upgrade my health... My healthiness. My happiness. Oh man, I think I'm gonna starve this winter. I don't think I have enough food. It's going up, it's going up. I, I understand that. Okay, what do we got? Colonizing shipbuilding erudition. Let's do this. Some 
once we're starting it. Go towards the enemies. The enemies. I mean, she does hit pretty hard. Oh, I don't get titles. Ooh, I'm negative eight. Oh, boy. This is gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt a lot. A lot, a lot. Attack. Oh, okay. One of these guys. Oh, boy. Yep. There we go. See? Look at that. You kill someone. One of, one of your warriors dies. Everybody's like, yeah! A warrior died. How awesome is that? Like, really? That's one good way to raise thing. Oh, here's the blizzard. So, as you can see. Quite blustery out. We're at negative 16 right now. Everybody keep your fingers crossed. Oof. There's really no point in doing anything right now because one thing you do get until you... Let's see here. Oh, they don't... Oh, yeah, here it is. Um, you have reduced power during the winter until you get that talent. So I'm going to say she most likely has it as well. It's not worth taking extra damage and not doing as much damage in a situation like this. Another month and a half. Oh, look at that food drop. She's going down. Oof. Mm. Everybody cross your fingers. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, ho, ho. there we go. I actually made it. Oh, that makes me happy. I will wait till it switches over to spring, and then if we can, we're going to feast. Or within a, couple, within a couple seconds of that, as soon as I get back up to 150 in food. I think they deserve it. Plus, it's always good to boost. It gets more and more expensive every time you do it, but I find, like... And plus, it'll raise the... There we go. Look at that. Bam! There you go. Everybody's happy. I'm happy. You're happy. Destroy the hell out of this place. Goodbye. You go over here. All right. Look at that. 24 food. That's great. All right. Where's another place that has food? We're going to need more food. My scout died. We need to go here. Um, I need another scout. I need more warriors. What do skirmishers do? I'm interested to know this. I can build like a champ. Um, I have an axe thrower camp. Shield bearer camp. Put you here. Losing a little on the food, but that'll be all right. We'll get those guys back to doing their thing in a minute. Where? Who? Who? Oh, you think. You freaking think. We'll 
run this guy around. die. Oh no, he did. He's right here. Alright. Man, it is rainy in this place. Alright. Let's go get us a, a farm. Hiya! Um, how about an axe thrower? I hear eat your zill. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Move, move, move. Hobnob! Alright, sent her over here. So far, I'm surviving. I need that scout to finish clearing. I gotta see who I'm up against. They clearly aren't that far, because this is almost the whole map right here. So... I just gotta keep plugging along. I need to make sure I have food. And we need to kill many people. You know what we're gonna do? Make some more money? And we'll do some trade with the kobolds. I don't need that much wood. Don't need that much wood. my warrior. My people happy yet? July? Alright. Also, if you see how this is neutral relations up there in the corner, or up, yeah, up there in the corner, um, there are clans like the Jotnar, the big the big dudes, you can trade with them and raise your reputation with them, and they'll come, you can summon Jotnar, and they'll be in your war bands and things like that. So there are certain things like trading is good for. The kobolds, I've never, I think I've only ever gotten to the next step up, never like the green smiley face, like, you know, we're just, we're friendly type thing. Um, the Jotnar I have because that's a, uh, that's a whatchamacallit. Uh, an achievement to get the Jotnar to fight with you. So, of course, I drag out a game to get the Jotnar, because I'm like that. I'm that person. Come on. I'm hoping... This will give me enough to get some more people. There we go. That was weird. Whip, whip, whip. Come on! Oh, it's August already. Eek! The good thing is this is a food tile, so this should help a lot. Let's get this guy over here. Oh yeah, they can't- there we go. Alright. There we go, finally! Somebody's happy with me. Oh, there's our- oh, we got fish over in this tile. This is the fisherman's hut right here. We got another forest. Kobold, so those tiles are out. So we gotta actually come in from around Yggdrasil, so I gotta come up this side along this way to get out here and get over here to them. Um, alright. Freaking scout. I know we'll get money for taking out this thing.
Can we upgrade this? Yes. Upgrading also improves happiness, too, of, like, the village huts and stuff. Okay. So people happy. I'm a nice landlord. Alright, you are getting your ass kicked. Holy crap. Also making... Uh, hey! Is it hard to change your... Uh, it's time-consuming. Very time-consuming. Like, the Jotnar... To do it with the Jotnar is not easy. It's prob You're probably talking 30 minutes of consistent, consistent background trading with them. Let's start that. should build a defense tower. I should build defense towers here. What do we got? What do we got? Guerrilla tactics. Hmm. Yes. Thank you. Ooh, goody. Do we want... Reduces loss of food during winter, plus three happiness. I'm going to go reduces loss of food. That way I can make sure that we still keep keep it up. Sheesh. Alright, we're gonna... I'm gonna have these two hang back here and get healed. In case some of these guys spawn, because this is a drow Draugr uh, tomb, so they'll continue to spawn over here. Okay. These Valkyries are tough. However, I can just colonize this and, and win the game. There's different things, that uh, different ways of winning. But like I said, fame is not one of them. The clan of the snake cannot gain fame. Current age, pride of the clan. Tears of Earth is my next next one. In two, what that say, 803. So if we can make it through the winter and make it to 803, I will now have that scorched earth ability and I can go on a rampage depraved uh oh portals to hell uh we've got oof all right I'm gonna put you there You, sir, you, sir, you're also going to be a warrior because I need two people over here. All right, this is no good. Okay. That means we got to take overtake this area, too. It's all right. Das is all right. Okay, this guy's gonna come help this axe person over here. Alright, we got a month before they... Th obviously, a month in this time. The graphics of this game are really quite nice. Even close up, they're not bad at all. You can still see everybody stylized. Everything looks good. I think they've done a great game with... with the, or a great job with this game. It's, uh... It's very addicting, and like I said, once you get, like, the tiles have different bonuses and things like that, and how each clan plays, it's a ton of fun. I think I've played all the clans and won with all the clans so far in various ways. Um, obviously, Clan of the Snake, the guys I'm playing now, just came out. This is the new DLC. Hence why we're going, going for the gusto. 
look at this. Look at this. This guy just ran across the line. Oh, no, you don't, Farmer, Farmer Odell. Get out of here. Oh, there we go. Oh, yes. All right. All right, come on, come on, come on. I need this farmer out of there. He's getting ass beat. All right. You, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Woo! Okay. All right. Heal up, people. Um, oh, I knew one was going to spawn down here. Shoot. We need another mine here. I mean, it's a good game. I, I've, like I said, I've already invested 55 hours in this game. It's definitely well worth. If it goes on sale, you know, just when you can, pick it up because. It's fun. There's a lot of different things. Some some um, of the clans, you get to have, like, marauders, so you got to build a long dock and then send raiders out, and you get to select areas of the other, um, the other side's beach and stuff like that and go raid them. Like, it's... It is really quite cool. All right, this guy's going to hang back. And we're gonna take this dude over. I only have one on this right now. Yes, I do. We're gonna improve tools as well. I need farmers and hunters. That's really all I need to worry about right now. That helped a little bit. 200. 50, Jesus. I need colonization. Hey, yay, yay. All right, let's get these people healed up again. I can only have one. Oh, okay, that's good. I'm still making decent money. We got our mind going. These kobolds are not going to attack me. Which is, ooh, another food tile. Ooh. Yum yum. Definitely need this iron though. You want to really, really go for the resource tiles, especially when you're doing like up against four clans. You can go up against four or five clan, other clans in this, and uh. Shoot. Three more. Yeah. All right. They need the same. I'm still beating them. Let me see here. I can't. I can't do this. Take control of it. How are they farther ahead of than me? Oh man. Build a lighthouse. Commercial influence. That's a trade victory. I'm going to dominate these people. If I can't take the... Well, if I can't dominate them, then I'll go for Yggdrasil, but... Uh, Twitch has been messing up for you. Well, it looks like there was just an alert from... Uh, that uh, Twitch support tweeted something out. It says, we've received... We've recovered from the issue preventing certain parts of the pages from loading correctly. So something must be going on. Uh-oh. Okay, so here's another natural disaster that happens. Um, these are earthquakes. When the earthquakes hit, hits, as you can see, again, shows it on the map, like three or four buildings will take damage and you have to repair them using um, villagers and wood. Which, you know, nothing, nothing like super crazy, but still, you know. Wow, look at that. Down from 200 and something. Sheesh. All right, as soon as we take this, we're going to move into this group over here. There we go. Oh, I got five iron for that. That's great. Why do I only have three people over here? 
Oh no, they're here. Oh, someone died. That sucks. With too many wounded? Oh. I need I need more healers. You know what? Hold on a minute. Let's load another healer up over here. Okay. I'm under attack. Are you kidding me? I knew this son of a bitch was going to attack. Should have built this earlier. Alright. 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 Um, let us get another warrior. gonna go with another warrior for right now. Um, yeah. I'm doing it. I'm crazy for doing this. It's probably gonna screw me, but... It's alright. It's okay. What we're going to do is... Frey, lead Raven Clan. All right, these guys. These guys are a testy little bunch here. Oh shit, they took this over. Damn, that's where I was heading to. Guess I'm just gonna have to take that back, aren't I? Um, hmm. Under pressure. What does under pressure mean? Oh, okay. So we need a skirmisher. Let's try this out. What is this skirmisher? Since this is a new military unit, let's try it out. Let's put them... So they can go behind... They can go behind enemy lines? Is that... Is that the gist of this? Didn't this guy ever finish building this? No? Let's go send him over here. Skirmishers are lightweight units that trade offense and protection with mobility and stealth. Oh. They're building a food silo over here. Oh, when I said... Whoa, 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 whoa. Lightweight is right. Holy crud. You can do some damage with a whole group of them, though. That's for sure. I can't get these guys into here well I can oh yeah 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 I might have to kill those things <laughs> yeah let's do it how much food do I have all right hold on I just lost someone all right they're building up their defenses here I'm coming for you Raven clan I'm in my territory, right? Yes, I am. Doing good on food. So far, so good. Alright, so here comes the earthquake. So let's see what gets messed up here. Usually it only takes all wood, but... Sometimes... It can be a little more, depending on what it is. What do we got? We got two over here. No, just one. Okay. Up. Oh, there we go. Alright, that's almost fixed. Oh, Jesus. Hold on. You stay over here. You go fix this. Oh, they're already assigned to it. Never mind. Never mind. Still doing good. Yes. There we 
go. That's good. Next. All right. We need three hundred and thirty. And there's no other fishing tile except this one. That sucks. Usually you'll get like at least two fishing tiles. Though I'm surprised there's two farming tiles, to tell you the truth. Usually you'll Actually, three! I take that back! Sometimes the food, like the, the food tiles, can be really few and far between. And that can make, a, make or break a game, too. Like... It, uh... Sometimes it's not so great. Um, 10, 150... Let's do it. I'm gonna have to take the dive here. We're gonna upgrade them. Uh, we're gonna upgrade the hunters. Uh, let me... Where's my other farm? We're gonna upgrade these guys, too. Yes. Okay. Okay. There we go. That definitely helped. That's good. Good, good, good. We have improved tools, so we're not doing horrible. Let's do another warrior. There we go. All right. Let's go whoop some butt. Let us go kick some tuckus. We're gonna get in here, and then we're gonna take over their land right here and start pushing back on them. I need another scout, though, that's for sure. Um, there's no villagers in this? I have one villager left. We cannot not do anything with him. We're gonna have to wait on that. I wish we got meat from these, that would be great. Bam! Nice. Alright. Alright, we definitely need these guys to heal, because that is lowering my health. Let's see here. Gorilla Tactics. Monster Slayer. Mm. Healers will gather food. Alright. We're gonna do that. What is this? Permanently increased population growth speed by 20. Raises to 50% during six months. Oh, that's new. That wasn't like that before. It used to be a flat 30%. Okay. All right. Actually, hold on a minute. Let me see some of these other things. This is still... This used to be 15, I believe. This was 30. This was 20%, if I remember. So it looks like they upped things. Oh, that's definitely upped. That was, I think, 10% before, or 15%. This should be 50%. Unless they changed it, or it could just be for the Snake Clan. Erudition, that they upped. That they changed. That they changed. Yeah, they definitely changed quite a few things here. Reduces what? That's nice, too. Definitely some good changes to this. We're moving along here. Oh, they're building a defense tower. We need to... 
take these guys over now. Goodbye. Get out of here. Get out of here. Peace out. All right, let's take this back. Then we should be able to purchase it. I should probably build another silo just in case. Um, we'll put it here. Good, we're up to three villagers. That's a good thing. That's good. All right. Oh, yes, food reserves is one of the newer things that uh, raises happiness for these guys, too. So, we get to use her Scorched Earth. Oh yeah, I need a scout. I can't go anywhere without this damn scout. And upgrade. Alright, so... Scout, I need you here. Another blizzard incoming, alright. Okay, 1100, that sh should be good. This is unlimited. I like how, like, the wood's unlimited. Like, you don't have to worry about those things. You just really need to worry about your food. Another thing with the silos, which we haven't come up against yet. I don't know if it's going to come up, the but another one of the um, environmental, like, catastrophes is rats um, attacking your food and... Um, eating it and poisoning your people giving them plague and stuff like that so that's another thing man look at my food go let's party everybody all right okay can i we're colonizing this i'm being this much of a jerk They're gonna have to come through past my tower. I'm a mean, horrible individual. Where's my miner? Your mine is beat up? No problem. I have an iron mine for you right here. Get some resources back. Good deal. Beware I'm under attack by who? Uh, 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 uh. Send my people back real quick. If I, uh, the reason I run these guys around is because if I leave, you saw how I took over that tile from the enemy, this guy will take this tile back from me. So, the skirmishers can run right through without getting attacked. Oh, excuse me. These poor guys gotta like, go all the way around. Okay. Um, where did my other guys go? There they are. Not even running, they're like, screw this. Alright, where is my scout? I'm just putting my scout to this one real quick. We're gonna see which plan of attack we're going in here and taking this clan out. Kind of a jerk move right there. Crippled them that way. Oh, you know what? Fisherman's hut. I have to wait for these to burn down. Bishop World, thank you for the follow! Welcome, adventurer! Come on, come on, come on! Blow up! Blow up! Oh, this is on free-for-all. We're checking out the, uh, snake clan. Ooh, Frey's mad at me. Little bit mad at me. And a little bit of I don't care. Alright, I believe if we... ...kill people... ...we make people happy, so let's... ...let's maim and plunder. Max 
maxed out my food there for a minute. You'd think they'd be happy with uh, food reserves. All right. The cool thing is, is I've done this before, and this is a really jerk move. Um, I've starved other clans out, because once you start starving, everybody's health starts going down. I have starved them out so bad, it's not even funny. Alright, I need you... Wow, look at how small they're... Oh, hello. Ravens... I don't think have more... I think the ravens are the ones with the marauders, actually. So we need to get the show on the road here. Is the, I was going to say, is the sheep coming to attack me? Really? That's just a joke. Get out of here. What the hell you think you're doing? Oh, well, my people are happy now. They're like, kill, die, death, yes! Alright, I need you to heal. I like this game a lot. I already have 55 hours in this game. Um, you know, I actually play it a lot not on stream. I've only just started playing the campaign, which they added a little while ago, but, um, I, like, the, the single-player campaigns, these, you know, the map mode, everything like that, they've done a great job on this game. This new clan's pretty cool. They, they definitely have some different... Definitely different options. So we've got four. So we, I'm gonna probably do guerrilla tactics next, and that should help me wipe the re wipe the rest of these people out. So let's get um let's get an axe thrower and a warrior. Oh shoot! Totally forgot about that. Where is she? Oh! Oh, excuse me, they won! Excuse me! Alright, I'm gonna wait to colonize that. We got three people. All right, you. Come get you some over there. And you as well. Okay. Looks like we've got one more tile up here to explore. And that's actually it. Ooh. Their death is approaching. Sucks to be them, huh? Mm. Let's do another axe thrower. Well, let's just let's just go in. Thrones of Britannia. I believe I did play Thrones of Britannia. I believe I got a press copy of that and tried it a while ago. I'm thinking, isn't that a um? Wasn't that an expansion to a Total War? Or something to that effect? Sounds very, very familiar. I like the, like, Total War games and RTSs. Like, I have certain games that I will always give a shot. Side-scrolling shooters, RTSs, and, like, walking simulators, puzzle-style games, Myst, Riven, Under Earth, those games. Like, I love those games. Love those games. But that's what I grew up playing, so... Oh, here we go, look. The death knell is upon them. Everybody wave goodbye to the Raven Clan, because we should be able to take them out now. This defense tower's gotta go, but that's alright. Alright, whoa, 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 whoa. How about we purchase this just to make... Just to be a jerk. We have too many wounded. Oh, don't worry. We'll be healing up no problem. Ooh, yes. Yes, gorilla tactics. Um... 
Tatsu happiness. Let's really crank it out. Sons of Ragnar. Sons of Ragnar. I love Viking stuff. But this is like, you know, when it comes to RTSs, you can either do a really good job or you can do a really cruddy job. This was done great. You have to micromanage each tile, but that's fine. Because once, again, once you get used to the mechanics and everything and what each clan does, the clan, the clan of the bear, you can summon a bear. Which is a badass. Clan of the wolf, you can use money to, um, uh, whatchamacallit, you can use money to colonize instead of food. You can also get food from killing wolves and stuff like that. So it's like, how about we take some of these people out? All right. Oh, I lost one. Oh. oh, yes. Yes. Thank you, Grimbone. You are the man. Here we go. She's going. She's going. Kablam! Do it! Do it! Oh, that ain't pretty. All right, so what is that going to do? Is it doing... I don't know what it's doing. All right, let's get us some more warriors and get us another axe thrower. I believe... Oh, I think it increases our damage by 50% or... Um, my clan's damage. Let me go back over here. Let's get you over here. I thought I selected another axe bearer. They didn't get... Oh, there they go. Alright. Let's let them catch up, and then we are... Hopefully going to put a good dent in these people. They're most likely starting to s gonna start starving now. Don't you worry. Don't you worry your little... Little heart out. Um, where's peoples? Where is some peoples that I can have built? Even though I really don't need it. What do you mean I'm under attack? Ah, uh, screw it. Who's under attack? Oh, that defense tower is going to take them out. Here, here we go. Oh yes, does a lot more damage a lot more quickly. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah! Go, 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 go! Alright, that is the biggest problem right there. Let's start. Okay, they are... How are we at? 10 out of 20 killed. At least we took that, that thing down. Alright, let's get some more people. Um, axe thrower. What is this? This is a rat infestation. I just don't feel like dealing with rats that are going to poison my people, and that's going to be a problem because then I'm going to get uh, lose happiness due to too many people ill. And it's a fight to be happy. Dagnabity. Might as well build a farm while I'm here, too. Oh, and while we're at it... There you go, Scout. You can explore that. Actually, I got two that you can explore. Everybody to run along. This is a three-month cooldown, so... Oh, it's back up! Watch out! Here we go! Oh, 
Whoa, whoa, no, no, you son of a bitch. Oh, I gotta wait. God damn it. Well, at least we can kill more people. We'll whittle them down. Of course, they had to build another defense tower. That's fine. We're gonna keep taking them out. I don't think she... Yeah, she can't be improved. is fine. I don't really need to... What is this? Oh! Wow, really? Already? Uh, do I have any other deposits to mine? Or... Nice. You can come over here. Oh, I don't own that? No, I thought I owned that. Oh no, that's the fisherman. <laughs> ah! Yeah, we don't want him exploring nothing. Guess we'll come over here. We can build that. Hundred and fifty, I have that. That's good. See, I have good relations with the Kobolds. Nice. I don't think I can trade. Yeah, I don't I might be able to walk through their territory now without them attacking me, but I can't guarantee that. Since usually I actually don't get this this far with them. Kobolds really don't have a, uh, you know. I'll trade- I'll start trading with the Jotnar first, before I, uh... I trade with the, uh... Kobolds most of the time. Alright, I need you... to be a fisherman. Come on! This is a good game. You can get so lost in this game. The campaign, from what i played so far, I think I've only done, like, five boards of the campaign or something like that, but, like, the campaign's been pretty freaking good, too. What I noticed is they have you going through different the different clans, so, like, on the board I'm on, I'm using the Clan of the Raven. Now, I don't know if they're going to add into the campaign the Snake Clan, or this is just strictly for... You know, when you play like this. Alright, Siggy. Shoot, four people got diseased. Damn. Oh, I see people taking damage because they have no healer. Hmm. Come on, healers. What are you? You're a scout. How about we make you a farmer? And then you'll have a job. Plain and simple. You've already scouted the whole damn island. Get to work. Bam! There you go. That worked out just fine. Up. Oh. Mmm. I don't need to steal lore. However, I am gonna up her attack. Because... Come on, come on, come on. Who's under attack? Oh, shit! I didn't even think about that. I need you. Where'd I go? I didn't even think about that. Oh, a Valkyrie of all people. Great. Valkyries are hard as hell sometimes. Alright. See, like, how I said, like, there's a joke of calling this the Viking Starving Sim. 
I, I, maybe it's the way I play. I always make sure that I have a lot of food before I go anywhere or continue or I'm always looking for food, but I, I don't necessarily find the food hard to, hard to keep up as much as the happiness. See how these people are starting to get low? They might be dying from starvation. Because they have only villagers collecting food, and that's it. And I highly doubt that's enough. We're gonna keep taking them out. How many more do we have to get to 20? It's three more, and then we're maxed out on our damage. Ooh, we're evil. That's really a, a nice little dirty thing. Again, this is the snake clan, clan only. Anything with these snake symbols. For the, the black market. I haven't even attempted the black market. I'm too busy killing this dude to trade with him. We're gonna die a miserable death. Let's get nice and close. Ooh, we got a dead guy now. Running fast now. Come on. Oh, yeah. Bring it on. This is the epic battle. Oh, she is doing a lot of damage. Clunk. Oh, we got this. We got this. Took a little bit. Here we go. I would like to thank the Academy and thank the Raven Clan for being such a great sport, but uh, obviously us snakes are far better than you damn birds. Go. This should end it, because obviously they don't have a, a home base a home thing here, so... I gotta go make myself more tea. And then obviously, you can see what you did. If you're someone that likes to see how things happened, I got Domination Victory, of course. Um, but it lets you see what steps were taken, stuff like that. It's, it's very, very well done. Let me get the title. So that was the Snake Clan. Woo! Stretched out. There we go. Let me uh, exit the game. So that was the Snake Clan. It was nice looking at... Well, first off, checking out the skirmishers. Those are pretty cool. Um, I believe they said that those should be available.